Hey there, this is James Gall with a monthly word of exhortation on Be Still. The theme verse comes from Psalm 46, verse 10, where it simply says, Be still and know that I am God. I will be exalted among the nations. I will be exalted in the earth. Be still and know that I am God. This word that's used here on and know, it's not the word for information. It's a word of intimacy. And so to move into a realm of knowing God and being invited into the same realm of us knowing God in the level that God knows us is that there's a, um, see, what is that called? A precondition. Be still. Now that's not easy for a lot of us, is it? Be still and know. And know. Be still and know. You know, some of us, I hope that you can connect with this. Some of us in modern society, you might not. But it's like those old snowscapes. Little things, you know, that you have and it's an ornament and you can shake it. And that's like our lives. And it's also busy. And then you got to set it down. And then it all comes in to place. And then there's a beautiful scene. And that's often the way our lives are. One time the Holy Spirit spoke to me a phrase and he said, Quietness is the incubation bed of revelation. That set me on a journey on trying to learn how to quiet my soul before God. We are the temple of the living God. And just like the temple of the Old Testament, there's the outer court, the inner court, and the most holy place. So there is also a lot more noise in the outer court less noise on the inner court, and there's no noise in the inner court at all. So we go on a journey of learning to quiet our interior activity in order to be still. Now this is totally different from Eastern Meditation. By the way, I wrote a whole book on the lost art of practicing his presence. So you might want to like consider reading that. But for a monthly word of exhortation, I have something really simple for us. I get so busy sometimes, and so do you, that we forget the elementary things. And I would like for us to consider this right now. There is so much craziness going on. Be still. Pause. There is a word in the Psalms. It's called Selah. Do we know what that means? All it means is pause. Let me give us one more verse. It's from Isaiah chapter 30, verse 15. For thus says the Lord, the Holy One of Israel, in repentance and in rest, you'll be saved. In quietness and trust is your strength. Quietness. Quietness is the incubation bed. Incubation bed of revelation. Hey, this is James Gall. And I just want to give us a word of exhortation. To be still. And to go on the journey into the tabernacle of God. 
And so I bless you right now that you will go past the noise of the outer court and you will come into your secret place where there is a quiet place. And you will hear him in the mercy seat of God. Amen. God bless you. James Gall. Be still and know him.